This is a K-Texas News Update. Good Tuesday morning. It is 8.56. Leading our news this morning tonight from 6 until 9.30. All registered sex offenders on probation will have to report to the old Taylor County Courthouse to help protect your kids. It is a program called the Lights Out Program. It is the first year sex offenders on probation in Nolan, Fisher, and Mitchell counties will have to participate in that program as well. The suspect in Adam Garcia's murder, you see him there, Orlando Hawkes, was arraigned at the Taylor County Jail yesterday. Hawkes is accused of shooting and killing the 26-year-old father of three. Police say foul play is evident, but they're not releasing a motive. Hawkes's bail is set at $250,000. The Abilene Taylor County Public Health District will host a flu clinic on November the 8th at the Civic Center from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. You can get a flu shot or a pneumonia vaccine at that clinic. Now let's get a check of this morning's weather with Storm Team Meteorologist Chad Garneau. Good morning, Chad. Good morning, Laura. It is very cold outside. As you see temperatures behind me, 46 degrees in Abilene, 45 in Sweetwater. With a little bit of those gusty winds, it could probably feel a little bit more into the lower 40s. So you might be seeing your own breath as you walk outside. But for the rest of the day, though, we'll see plenty of sunshine and temperatures reaching around the lower 60s. Winds to the northwest at 10 to 20 miles per hour. For tonight, we'll be very cool around the upper 40s, or excuse me, the lower 40s. Winds will be got calming down around 5 to 10 miles per hour under mostly clear skies. For the rest of the week, you're going to see that temperatures are going to pretty much stay around the 60 degree marker and we could see some rain chances coming into Thursday, Saturday, and even into Sunday. So enjoy the calm weather and cool weather while you can. That's a look at your weather for this morning. Have a great Halloween day.